welcome to Live at Zero BPM, bringing live music to you tonight. It's the Paul Paris Project featuring Paul Paris, Brandon Fields, Mitch Foreman, and Ernest Tibbs. If you care to donate, click on the donate slash tip jar link in the description or on our website at live at zero bpm.com slash tip jar. You can also tip on Venmo at zero bpm. And now, let's get to the music with your host, Grammy Award winning percussionist and mallet player, Billy Holting. All right. Hey, everybody out there at Internet Land. Uh, thanks for showing up, sir. We've had some uh, technical difficulties, some ghosts in the machine today. And, uh, uh, you know, do a, do a live stream, they said. It'd be fun, they said. And here I am. So anyway, the guys have been awesome and amazingly patient. But like the guy in the intro says, let's get to the music. Let me pull the, pull the gang up here and uh, switch over to them. There we are. Hey, guys, how are you? Good. Good? We're amazing. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for waiting. Yes, Appreciate thank you for waiting. And if you have friends that are looking for us over on Facebook, I posted like 10 times what the new URL is on Facebook. Looks like we got 15 people over there already. And we've already got uh, six people on YouTube. So uh, I'm not gonna, I'll announce the regulars who I already see here and uh, excited that they're back. And I'll announce some more. We had some pre-tips tonight, which is awesome. If you want to tip li you know, live at Z-E-R-O-B-P-M, uh, live A-T, that, you know, slash tip jar. I'll put it up in the chat room so you can find it. And uh, Paul, what are you going to play for us first? We're going to play Tom Scott's arrangement of Cannonball Adderley's tune, Jive Samba. Sweet. One, two,
Thank you, everybody. Uh, so <laughs> it seems like everybody found us. We got the crowds are growing, and you know what? We're getting a lot of early tips. I wanted to just say wow. thank you to. Thank you. Uh, let's see, James and Gloria pre-tipped. That's right. James Amazing. tipped this morning, and Gloria tipped a couple of hours ago. I hope they're here watching. If you are, say hi in the chat rooms. Tell us where you're from. We want to know where everybody's watching from. <laughs> but also, I want to say that Michael and Chris also tipped. Chris is our regular from Hawaii that comes to all the shows. Uh, Anika or Anika, please forgive me if I'm pronouncing your name wrong. And Fred have tipped as well. So thank you all so much. I just put the links up in the uh, in the sh in the chat rooms and everything. Unfortunately, Twitch isn't working again, and it's because the link expired. It worked an hour ago, but they expired it on me. So I'm not going to be able to get Twitch up. I hope we get the people over here. But of course, the regulars are here. Toby's here. Phil O'Connor's here. Susan is here. Hi, Susan. Uh, let's see who else. A lot of people jumping in. Lorca is here. Hi, Lorca. And Jane. Hey, Jane. How are you doing? Let's see. Toba. Oh, there's Annika. She's on Facebook. And a whole bunch of people. So uh, this is great. So this is, this is nice. We've, this is our first horn player in the big room. And we couldn't pick a better cat than Brandon Could not Fields, pick a better we? cat than Brandon. No way. And uh, Mitch is here also. We wanted him to play forever. Ernest, this is, I think, your third time here, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. yeah. And this is Paul's first time. So first welcome, time. everybody. Yeah. Beautiful room. Thanks for having us, Billy. It's great. Sure. What are you going to play for us next? This is an original tune uh, I wrote for uh, my dedication to the great island of St. Kitts, where I got my start as a solo artist. The moniker for that island is Sugar City, and this tune is called Sugar City.
is an arrangement by the late, great Jeff Golub, amazing guitar player, uh, who I work with and Mitch also worked with. So since we're playing together tonight, I wanted to dedicate this and play this uh, arrangement of his, Cold Duck Time. Very cool. <laughs> Thank you. 
I need to shout out to Lorca and who I think Lorca is oh it didn't say where they're from maybe New York I think Lorca and then Michael my friend Michael also tips so thank you guys you know uh, we're entirely tip based so if you're digging the band you know please uh, help out I'll put the links back in the in the tip jars but I, I always ask where people are from and we have Diana hi Diana from Houston she's a regular Joyce is watching from Seattle and uh, Diana's in Houston so and she's a regular also so that's great and uh, you have a comment from uh, Lawrence says uh, truly appreciate the groove you're laying down right now. <laughs> Thank you, Laura. Appreciate that. Oh, th there's a question out there? Uh, oh, i got to come in and I can't hear him. The only person I can hear is Paul. Oh, Tom, what do you want? He wants a sax in the monitor. Oh, you got a sax in the monitor, please. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the next song we're playing is called The Basement. It's um, the first tune off my latest album, which actually drops tomorrow. The album is called Falling Awake. All these amazing players are on it. Uh, I'm very proud that I wrote all the songs. Um, so please uh, run to your nearest iTunes application, Spotify application, um, Amazon, YouTube, etc. 
to give it a listen. Um, please uh, um, subscribe to my channel. And uh, here we go. The basement. Hold on a second. Brandon, I think I put you in the little tiny monitor as well. That was turned off in here. So, and I turned this up as well, the, the big speakers. Uh, Okay, try it again. There we go. There we go. Okay. Why? And I put you in the small speaker, so this is, uh, we're, we're showing you. <laughs> okay. One, two, three.
Thank you. Yeah, too kind. Hey, uh, we, we got a lot of comments here, but Paul, I need you to say about the album release again. Uh, Human Error, I had that mic off. We were hearing you through Brandon's mic. So oh, wow. Can you tell okay, everybody okay. about the release tomorrow? Okay. Uh, the album release tomorrow. <laughs> There's, uh, I have a new album out uh, called Falling Awake. It releases tonight at midnight uh, on all the streaming platforms. Uh, would love you all to listen to it. Love to hear, hear what you think. Um, iTunes, Amazon, uh, Spotify, YouTube, etc., etc. The great Randy Brecker is on it. Uh, Bob Reynolds, Mitch Foreman, Brandon Fields, Ernest Tibbs, Will Lee, Hadrian Faro, a lot of great Alfonso Johnson, a lot wow. of great players, and um, Meredith Salambini, Mike Landau, Osnoy. So um, please. Run, run to your nearest uh, music app and uh, please have a listen. Appreciate it. I wrote all the songs, so I'm very proud of it. That's very Most cool. Helpful. Well, we got a, we got another tip from Mike. Uh, he's, he sent a tip in, so thank you, Mike. He's a good friend of mine. And he also reminded me to tell everybody, if you're enjoying the show, you know, if you leave a tip, you get put on the mailing list, but you can also go to the website and get on the mailing list. And if, if you, we do this every Thursday night, and then twice a month I do a talk show version. Uh, in fact, after the next two, and I'll show you the upcoming schedule, what's coming up here. But... Uh, you know, tell a friend, bring friends. We're grassroots. We're just trying to keep jazz going in, in L.A. We started out in June of last year, coming up on our one-year anniversary. Got a big uh, mash plan for that. So anyway, but a couple of other comments. Michael said, great rendition of Cannonball. You know, <laughs> he's one of the guys that tipped. Uh, Julie is in Tampa. She says, hello. Mike wants to know when you guys are playing the Bull or the Greek. Do you have a date yet? The, the two of them are fighting over us. So, uh, uh, you know, okay, that makes we'll, sense. Whichever Victor comes out, we'll let you know. And then, you know, we had, I, I can't find the name, but somebody said, I got to run, I'll be right back. They put that in the chat room, which I thought is kind of cool. It's almost like they're here with us. And I just wanted you guys to know in case you noticed they left the room. Are we supposed to wait or should we continue? No, I think we, she said, okay. she, she said, go ahead. She'll be back as soon as she can. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Uh, Toby's loved the bass, and she's digging the body language. So Toby's a big fan of the bass. She's, she helps us out a lot. He, he, he gets that a lot. <laughs> I'm sure he does. And let's see. I know you, Toby. <laughs> yeah, Lorca says, uh, love the basement. That was a great song. Uh, and we got a bunch of other uh, comments here. Let's see. I'm, I'm, okay, Chris says that one. Oh, see, he said, oh, my God, nasty good. So you guys got some new fans out there and, and whatnot. Cool. So, cool, cool, cool. And it's cool that people not from L.A. are able to watch these because they don't have access to cats like you all the time. So this is great. Anyway, why don't you guys play something?
solos by Brandon Fields, Artist Tips, and Mitch Foreman. Yeah, that, that was cool. <laughs> um, and we got a new tip, Lawrence. Thank you, Lawrence. He says, uh, he just says, thank you for the music. So uh, I'm getting a little behind on the comments here. <laughs> um, but uh, anyway, what, uh, let me do a quickie thing here, guys. Give me a few seconds. I'm going to just talk about the upcoming shows. Let's see. This, uh, well, a week from tonight, we have the Dave Dirge Trio, and that's with Kevin Axt and Quinn Johnson on keys. And then uh, we have, I'm working in another band. Uh, somebody had to bail on the 27th, but I'll have somebody else in there. I'll let you know soon. Uh, Jazz Roundtable on the first. Composers, Gordon Goodwin, I think, and some other guys, so, uh, kind of got some big band guys. So, uh, hold on. Uh, then after that is Conganus. That's the full orchestra Latin qu quartet that they played a couple months ago, and they, people love them. Then the Tony Jones Vocal Project is coming in. After that, Jazz uh, Roundtable number eight at Sax Night, and, and I'm, I think, uh, I think Brandon might be joining us. We're working on that. And then after that, I've got to wait for the graphic. David Hughes is bringing a trio in again, and then we got a bunch more for July, August, already booked in September. So anyway, let's get back to the band here and. Uh, so what you got for us, what you got for oh.
couple of comments I just really have to read. Like, I forgot Tom Meek was one of the first people here. And Tom Meek said to say hi to everybody. And uh, <laughs> so it's great to see Tom here. But also David Dirge says hello. Christy says wow. Eric says wow. And Brad says these cats are solid together. Like the, uh, the flutey keyboard sound a couple of tunes ago. So anyway, what, what else you got for us there, Paul? Well, we didn't have Paul. You didn't announce the last song. Yeah. Yeah. Is this the last one? I don't know. The last song before the last one. I don't know if this next one's the last one, but it might be. No, nah, we got time. But the last song was called I Just Want You. Now, are these songs all on the new album? or They're all on the new album. Okay, yeah. so yeah. Uh, well, put a, you know, give me a link to that, and I'll put it out in Monday's newsletter. Amazing. Love it. Yeah, no, you've been great. And it's uh, we've got a good little crowd here, so a lot of people. I can't read all the comments. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm without a snare on the snare drum. But it's kind of fun. I kind of actually, think it's kind of muddy, yeah. Sounds good. I could be your sound. Cool. Thank you. <laughs> All this right. tune is called It's My World. I originally recorded it as a vocal tune. And um, I was in the studio with Mike Miller and Alfonso Johnson uh, a few years ago. And we recorded a few tunes. And this was my favorite. And I uh, never released it. So I made it part of this album. I also wrote it. And um, these guys are interpreting it really beautifully. So this is called It's My World. Hope you enjoy it.
you. That was great. Aren't these guys amazing? They are. And you get some good comments. Uh, Diana, who's one of our regulars, has said, how lovely. The sax player is just beautiful. Or absolutely beautiful, she says. So thanks, Diana. He, he's one of our favorite people, so you're right. He is. Brandon's awesome. I love he's, Brandon. Yeah, and then... Uh, 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 and then three or four people have said that we have to have you guys on more, so we'll see what we can okay, do. Okay, we love that. And, we love uh, hearing that. Thank you. James says, what a great show and all that. And uh, is it time for the, oh, is it encore time? Sure. <laughs> I'm doing on, hey, hey, Billy, do you have any tape, like a piece of... Uh, yes, I do. Yeah? I'll, I'll be right like in there. a thick piece of uh, duct tape or something like that? Thank you. I asked for it, I got it. So this next tune was written by um, one of the most amazing composers and uh, musicians uh, to ever grace uh, planet Earth, uh, Don Grolnick. Uh, it's called Nothing Personal. Um, maybe we'll make it something personal tonight, but uh, we're gonna end with that. Give me one sec. I'm just going to say, by me bringing the tape in there, it's proof that these rooms are connected to each other. <laughs> but it's nice. It's, this has been fun. Some nice colors. You know, we have a lot of guitar groups, which are awesome. It's nice to have the keys. It's really nice to have the sax. We had a trombone player about a month ago with Conganas, and it's really nice. Uh, and while you're taping that up, let's see. Gloria says, fabulous. Uh, every week, she says. Joyce is saying, uh, it's Stevie Wonder's birthday. Lorca says, that was a great song. Loves this. Uh, Toby, of course, is loving this. Angela says great. Mike says great. So, yeah, did I did I fill enough time for you there? I think so. Okay, take it I away, think you guys. Did.
fantastic. Hey, thank you, guys. Uh, thank you so much. Yeah, Paul, introduce everybody again real quick. Brandon Fields on saxophone. Mitchell Foreman on keys. Ernest Tibbs on bass. I'm Paul Paris. Thank you so much. Thank Love you, you, Paul. Thank you, everybody out there. We'll see you next Thursday. Let me play my little outro video. I spent all week on this, so please watch. <laughs> and I hope uh, you all have a great weekend. Take care. Thanks for joining us at Live at Zero BPM. These videos will be archived on YouTube and Facebook, so tell your friends. Coming up, two shows on Tuesday, May 18th. It's the Jazz Roundtable number six, Wrecking Crew Night, featuring Don Randy. On Thursday, May 20th, it's the David Dirge Trio, featuring David Dirge, Quinn Johnson, and Kevin Axt. Showtime, 7 to 8 p.m. Pacific. And as always, it's free, though donations are greatly appreciated. Go to live at 0bpm.com for details and to sign up for our mailing list. Also, find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. These Jazz Roundtable shows will also be released as a podcast, so please subscribe. See you soon.